This is such heavy news to cover, but there is a silver lining here. Kevin, as you know, there are people in our community who are really searching for solutions to this violence, especially among teens. And one business owner wants to simply give kids in our area a chance. You know, his store is on Truist Avenue. It's called One Pair. Growing up, um, that's where it came from, One Pair. I didn't have too many shoes growing up. My friends was my leverage. They gave me shoes to help me feel good, make me feel good when I go to school. And that's where it came from. And how many of us can relate to that, right? That experience and the idea that everyone deserves one pair of good shoes. Create an opportunity for kids in Kansas City's urban core. 41 Action News anchor Gabriella Pagan explains how it's making an impact. Welcome to One Pick. It's a shoe store, clothing store, and education center. Designed, created, and run by the youth of Kansas City's urban core. It took me 10 years to learn life, how to turn my hustles into a corporation. Uh, shouldn't be that way. Founder Jaron Thornhill says growing up, all he wanted was a chance. And that's what kids are looking for now. At One Pair, you can buy, sell, trade. We have new used, we restore, we customize shoes, we do it all here. Reselling is a $2 billion dollar industry and my kids know the industry, the shoe culture. Not only do they know the culture, they create it. Thornhill gives some of the student managers like KJ Farmer part ownership in the shop, in turn helping them take ownership of their life. Just having the resources and the opportunities that you don't really have in an urban city as in suburban or south suburban schools or just neighborhoods. So I think building back up uh, truce and just building back up Kansas City uh, with all the negativity that you have, bringing some positivity to the city is like what we're aiming for. The shop at 5511 Truce sells clothing from six different local lines. Dear Purpose, I'm coming for you. Rent free. Because it costs so much to be in stores and to have overhead and these same local clothing lines are selling out their trunk and doing pop-up of shops and things like that. So we want to provide a space where they can sell their product and the kids can also push it. The extra profits from the low overhead go back into the building's expenses, which once again, the kids handle. And that's what I mean by operated. The kids know what it costs to run this building, what it costs to get inventory, what it costs to pay all the kids and keep everything going. So everything cycled back into the building. And we also do community events and giveaways. They just want a chance. And that's why One Pair was created to give these kids chances and give them opportunities to thrive in life and say, hey, I can do this. Gabriella Pagan, 41 Action News. You know, gentlemen, you can expect a visit by me. I <laughs> felt this story with every ounce of my body. That's a great story. One pair helping provide that one pair of good shoes through its kicks boxes. The kids came up with the concept. It's a mystery box filled with a pair of shoes, a clothing item, and a letter from staff at one pair. And when you pay for a box, it'll go to a student who graduated during this pandemic. Man, I love that. Mm -hmm. And these are the stories we like telling folks, stories of people working to make our community better and make a positive impact on others, just like those men there. Tell us about the good things you see happening and use the hashtag, we see you on social media. Oh, an incredible mm. story. In